need to brush my teeth. My breath stinks. <gasps> Why do I look like Christina Aguilera? 2007, that was like a lot of years ago. Is this real? Sis, let's go. You're gonna be late for school. School? I can't go to school like this. You look fine. Stop being dramatic. Let's go. Are you guys texting on blackberries? Duh, blackberries are so cool right now. I heard that they're coming out with this thing called the iPhone and there's no buttons on it. Like the first iPhone? It's supposed to be a huge deal. Did you guys see that Rihanna just released a new song? Really? Which one? It's called Umbrella. I really like it. Have you heard it? Yeah, it's great. Uh, I hope that my crush likes my new post. Oh, where did you post it? TikTok? Um, what's that? I posted it on MySpace. Please don't put me in 2007 again. Oh, great. We went even further back in time? Wow, that is a lot of glitter. And why are my lips so pale? Bailey, your makeup looks so good today. I love the eyeshadow. Uh, yeah, thanks. I think my mom's gonna get us the new gaming system coming out. What gaming system? It's called the Xbox 360. I'm excited. That sounds super cool. Can't wait. It's so futuristic. Wait, do you guys know who Taylor Swift is? No, does she go to school here or something? Ugh, I love Kanye West so much. You like Kanye West? Yeah, his new song Gold Digger just came out. I am obsessed with it. Mm. Could you feed my Tamagotchi while I go to the bathroom? I don't want it to die. I would love to. Wanna come over after school? We're gonna drink beer and watch VHS tapes. You know what? I'm good. Okay, I just want 2011. What? 2002, I was an infant. What happened to my eyebrow? What are you talking about? They look great. I have like six hairs left. Yeah, thin eyebrows are all the rage right now. I love them. Do you at least have something to fix my lips? Why would you need to fix them? You're already wearing lip gloss. Now let's go. Please tell me you're not using a Nokia. This is the best phone on the market right now. What else would I use? I have the biggest crush on Justin Timberlake. Who's your crush? Uh, Harry Styles. Who the hell is Harry Styles? He was a skater boy, she said see- You know that song? Yeah, it came out like a month ago. I'm so obsessed with it. I keep hearing it on the radio. Yeah, me too. Ew, everyone run, it's Jessica. She is so emo. What's wrong with being emo? I wanna go even further into the future. No! Are you kidding me? I don't wanna go back to 2020. Dude, we just got two weeks off of school. I think everyone's gonna go hang at Kyle's. Wanna go? I don't think we should. I know the government said stay inside, but we don't have to listen. We should listen to them and stay inside. Ugh, you are being so boring. We can just make TikToks instead. Why didn't I think of that? That is such a good idea. We should dress up as Visco girls. They're so trending right now. What do you think? Sure. Okay, in three, two, one. And I oops. And I oops. I think that was good. I'm so glad they brought scrunchies back. I'm gonna wear them forever, they're so cute. They're not. We should do the Renegade and then we can blow up. You know, I don't think I know it anymore. What do you mean, it just came out? Nothing. I'm so glad we got two weeks off of school. We're gonna be out of school for a lot longer than two weeks. What are you talking about? Please don't put me anywhere near 2020 again. 2060, I wonder if I can teleport. Uh, are you watching Instagram Reels? Yeah, everyone watches Reels now since they banned TikTok. No. I know, right? It's just not the same anymore. Wait, how did you not know it was banned? Everyone still talks about it. No, I, I knew that. It just still, it still hurts. Oh, yeah. Wait, what generation of iPhone do you have? Oh, I have the iPhone 69 Pro Max Mega Jumbo 4000. Have you heard Taylor Swift's new song? Taylor Swift still makes music? Yeah, she's on her 50th studio album. Hey guys, what's up? Whoa, where did you come from? Oh, I just teleported over here from Starbucks. Is that car in the air outside the window? That's a flying car prototype. It's kind of whack. At this point, I'm just scared to see what year I'm in. 3,000? That's a little bit of a jump. Hey, sis. Oh, hey, yeah, what's up? What are you doing? I'm scrolling through my Instagram feed. You don't have a phone in your hand. Oh, I don't need it. I got the chip that lets you see your phone screen through your eyeballs. Would you want to go to France so we can get some dinner? What do you mean? Do we have like a private jet now? Oh no, I was just going to put the car into water mode, then we can go. Water mode? Like it turns into a boat? Yeah, it's way faster too. Mom, have you seen my hover shoes? I can't find them anywhere. What are hover shoes? Shoes that let you fly into the air, duh. 
Um, are you doing okay? Yeah, I'm just processing. The hover shoes would go with my new vintage top. Vintage? What year is it from? I think that this one's from 2023, so long ago. Yeah, it's super cute. Why am I wearing sunglasses inside? 19? We've never gone below the year 2000. Hey, um, what day is it? New Year's Eve, December 31st, 1999. New Year's Eve, like about to be 2000? Yes, isn't it so exciting? Yeah, it's so exciting. I can't wait for the 2000s. I wonder what they'll be like. It's literally gonna be life-changing. Um, I think your pants are falling down. No, they're not. I'm just wearing low rise. They're supposed to be like this. I can see your thong. That's the style. It's called a whale tail. My inspiration is Britney Spears. Do I look like her? Yeah, it's great. What's your favorite song by her? Definitely Baby One More Time. It just came out a couple months ago. Have you ever heard it? I'm seriously in love. No, you'll have to show me. <laughs> Everything is gonna be so much better in the 2000s. It's like the future. It's not. What do you mean? How would you even know that? Oh, <laughs> I don't know. I was just guessing. Happy New Year, everyone! The 2000s! Woo! Okay, guys, it's 2000 and we're not dead yet. That's a good sign. I only went forward a day. I don't know how much time we have. Everyone said the world's gonna end. The world is not gonna end. All our computers are gonna malfunction because the year won't change. You're all gonna be just fine. If the world is gonna end, I need to call my mom and say bye to her. I'm living through this? Why are you not freaking out too? Do you know something that we don't? You know what? Yeah, the world is gonna end just like the dinosaurs. <gasps> no way! I knew it! I need to listen to Britney Spears just one more time. Oh my. You better still listen to Britney Spears while you can. What do you mean? Are we really gonna die? Nothing. I just bought 12 pairs of low-rise pants for no reason. You're gonna hate low-rise pants in like five years. I thought we were gonna die. Let's all take one more selfie. Is that a flip phone? Yeah, I'm gonna miss it. It's hot pink and I bedazzled it. Oh. Please just be taller than 5'3 and I'll be okay. Ah, uh, that's like gotta be a mistake, right? One foot? Are they a garden gnome? I don't understand. Are you okay? You're being so loud. I think something's wrong with my height thing. Ugh, I'm sure that it's fine. It says that they're one foot six. I don't have time to deal with this. Go to school, okay? Okay. Dude, it says that my soulmate is six mm. foot five. Lucky. I am all for a short king or queen, but uh, one six is really short, right? That's how tall children are. Yeah. You should go down to the office. I heard that they can fix it for you. You're right, thanks. Next. Um, excuse me. What can I do for you? I need some help with my soulmate height. Sure, no problem. What's your name? Bailey. Let me see. Oh, I see, there was a mistake. Um, your soulmate's 16 feet tall. What? Good morning, what year am I in today? Excuse me? Am I reading that right? What, 1807? Hey honey, go make me some lunch. I'm starving right now. I'm not making you lunch. I make myself microwavable meals every day. Um, what is a microwave? It's a wave that's really small. Oh, okay. That makes a lot of sense. I need to have a meal before I go and vote in this election today. An election? I want to vote too. That's really funny, sweetheart. Keep dreaming about it. I'm not kidding. Women are the only reason that any men exist. I'm sorry. What are you talking about? Can you give birth? Are you feeling all right? Should I call the doctor? I'm feeling splendid. Okay, well, could you at least go do the laundry then? You go do the laundry. Please tell me what is up with you today. I can see into the future. Please put me into a normal year. Nine. I better be able to 3D print with my eyes. What the hell is that thing? Oh, Steve, he's a cross between a giraffe and a dog. Isn't he cute? Yeah, if you want to have nightmares every night. I need to make a phone call. Can I use yours? <laughs> you are so funny. What's funny? I need a phone. Technology is so 4,000 years ago. Everyone gets a chip in their brain when they're born that lets you do the same things as a phone or a computer. What? I need some water. Where did my glass go? Oh, it's in the other room on the nightstand behind the white lamp. How did you know that? I can locate basically anything with my x-ray glasses. Can I try them? Yeah, here. Whoa, this is so cool. Ah, don't look at people. You can see through their clothes. I am so sorry. You're never using those again. Please put me into a normal year. Nine. I better be able to 3D print with my eyes. 
What the hell is that thing? Oh, Steve, he's a cross between a giraffe and a dog. Isn't he cute? Yeah, if you want to have nightmares every night. I need to make a phone call. Can I use yours? <laughs> you are so funny. What's funny? I need a phone. Technology is so 4,000 years ago. Everyone gets a chip in their brain when they're born that lets you do the same things as a phone or a computer. What? I need some water. Where did my glass go? Oh, it's in the other room on the nightstand behind the white lamp. How did you know that? I can locate basically anything with my x-ray glasses. Can I try them? Yeah, here. Whoa, this is so cool. Ah, don't look at people. You can see through their clothes. I am so sorry. You're never using those again. Please put me into a normal year. Nine. I better be able to 3D print with my eyes. Ah, wah, 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 wah. What the hell is that thing? Oh, Steve, he's a cross between a giraffe and a dog. Isn't he cute? Yeah, if you want to have nightmares every night. I need to make a phone call. Can I use yours? <laughs> you are so funny. What's funny? I need a phone. Technology is so 4,000 years ago. Everyone gets a chip in their brain when they're born that lets you do the same things as a phone or a computer. What? I need some water. Where did my glass go? Oh, it's in the other room on the nightstand behind the white lamp. How did you know that? I can locate basically anything with my x-ray glasses. Can I try them? Yeah, here. Whoa, this is so cool. Ah, don't look at people. You can see through their clothes. I am so sorry. You're never using those again. I'm really afraid to see what year I'm in. <laughs> How many zeros is that? Oh, sis, there you are. Do you want to go to the new dinosaur exhibit today? The what? Oh, yeah, they brought some of the dinosaurs back to life, just like that movie, Jurassic Park. People died in that movie. Don't worry, we're going to be just fine. It's nothing like that. Okay. Here, eat this before we go. What is it? An ultra mega energy pill, 5,000. It's so good. Don't be shy. Just eat it. We should go through the portal on 3rd Street. It's the fastest route. The portal, like in Minecraft. I'm sorry, what is Minecraft? I don't think I've ever heard of that. Actually, now that I'm looking, the dragon exhibit is way cheaper today. Want to go there instead? A dragon? We can ride them too. They just put a muzzle on it so it can't fire breathe or anything. Okay. What's that red thing on your bracelet? Oh, this? A self-destruct button. You have one too. A hundred? That means I'm the best. Did you just say that your score is a hundred out of a hundred? Yeah, isn't that a good thing? No, that means you are in dead last place. Sis, that is not a good score. It's probably because you have no friends. But I have friends. Not the squishmallows you bring to school. Those are my friends. Well, you need to make friends with real people if you want to raise your score at all. Hey, do you guys want to be friends with me? Absolutely not. Get away from our table, weirdo. Okay, I guess I'll just try someone else. Bailey, literally get away from our table or I'm gonna call the police. I think it's time you found out about the rumor. What rumor? Your ex told everyone that you stole from their house. Hey, um, excuse me. Here are some songs from the early 2000s that you probably forgot about. In a couple of my videos, you guys noticed that I have many, many ear piercings. So we're gonna do a little piercing tour and I'm gonna rate which ones hurt and which ones did not. On this side, I have four lobe piercings. Also, all of these earrings are from Binky Bell. She's amazing, I love her. The lobes are very easy to get and they heal really quickly. So like five out of 10, they're okay. On this side, I also have four lobes and then I went a little crazy. This snake in the middle is called a conch. For me, the conch was painful to get and it's extremely painful to heal. Probably an eight on the pain scale. This one up here is called a rook. It looks so cool, but the rook was also very painful to heal. It gave me headaches and at points I was nauseous. Still gonna go with eight out of 10. Lastly on this ear, I have a cartilage flat. Anything with cartilage is a little bit uncomfortable to heal, but that one was not that bad, probably a five. Now it's time for the only piercing that's not on my ears. Surprise, I have a belly button ring. This honestly didn't hurt at all, but it was a little bit annoying to heal. I'll give it a six out of 10. I think I wanna get a helix next. Let me know if I should do it. But the fantasy of us lives on inside my head And I'm trying not to give up I'm so sick, I put an effort in I got my tooth, don't give a shit And I won't beg Romance
Like short girls, please like short girls. Oh, five seven with black hair and emo. <laughs> I am none of those things. Um, are you okay? Why are you making that face? My soulmate doesn't like me. You haven't even met yet. Plus, I have never met anyone who didn't like you. Apparently, them. I'm not five seven and I can't grow. Please, I'm sure it's not that much of a deal breaker that you're short. Yeah, if I go get surgery to make my eyes blue. You are so dramatic. Calm down. Bailey, if your soulmate doesn't want you, I'll take you. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna throw up. Hey, don't you want a piece of this? You say one more word, I'm gonna go fart on your pillow. Ooh, please do, that sounds kinda hot. <sighs> I wish that my soulmate would be Megan Fox. Who doesn't have a crush on Megan Fox? She's just so perfect. I love her black hair and the blue eyes, plus she's the perfect height. Why does it feel like I'm never enough? Here's three emo songs from the 2000s that you probably forgot about. Today we're going to be doing my whole makeup routine backwards. Once again, I had to write it out because I'm down to one brain cell. Starting off with setting spray. Why am I so greasy? Eyeliner. I'm going to try my best to make this actually good. We're putting our eyeshadow right over top of the wings. This is where it gets bad. We're doing highlight. I'm going to use this as like a primer to make it super dewy. I look like a disco ball. Powder blush. I'm going to put a lot so I'm blushing from within, right? Bronzer. This is all just going to get covered up by foundation. I feel bonita. We're doing setting powder even though we have nothing to set. Someone just asked me to hang out. I think I'm gonna have to say no. Why is all of my makeup broken? Are you kidding me? That is not blending over all the powder. Now we contour. <laughs> I look like I got ran over. I really need this concealer to help me out. Foundation's just gonna erase everything. I'm gonna try to do this very lightly. Fix up these eyebrows. The final step is primer. I forgot to do my lips entirely. This is our final look doing my makeup routine totally backwards. I look like I dipped my face in oil, but let me know what challenge I should do next. Today we're gonna be doing my whole makeup routine backwards. Once again, I had to write it out because I'm down to one brain cell. Starting off with setting spray. Why am I so greasy? 
Eyeliner. I'm gonna try my best to make this actually good. We're putting our eyeshadow right over top of the wings. This is where it gets bad. We're doing highlight. I'm gonna use this as like a primer to make it super dewy. I look like a disco ball. Powder blush. I'm gonna put a lot so I'm blushing from within, right? Bronzer. This is all just gonna get covered up by foundation. I feel bonita. We're doing setting powder even though we have nothing to set. Someone just asked me to hang out. I think I'm gonna have to say no. Why is all of my makeup broken? Are you kidding me? That is not blending over all the powder. Now we contour. <laughs> I look like I got ran over. I really need this concealer to help me out. Foundation's just gonna erase everything. I'm gonna try to do this very lightly. Fix up these eyebrows. The final step is primer. I forgot to do my lips entirely. This is our final look doing my makeup routine totally backwards. I look like I dipped my face in oil, but let me know what challenge I should do next. Do you guys remember when I posted covers and you all said that I suck and should never sing ever again? If you don't remember, let me jog your memory with this clip. I know that you'll never feel sorry. There's always room for improvement. <laughs> So instead of doing covers, I have made my own music. So here's a clip from my new single, Romance is Dead, that comes out tonight at midnight. And I'm trying not to give up. I'm so sick of putting effort in. I'm trying to give a shit and I won't let it. Romance is dead. I don't know about you, but I think that was an improvement from the first clip, right? <laughs> right? I'm scared to even look. 2012, why would I need to be in 2012? Taylor, are you done in there? We need to go. Who's Taylor? Don't tell me I'm in someone's body again. Miss Swift, you've been in there 40 minutes. Miss Swift, no. There you are, the car is waiting for you outside. Where are we going? To your live performance, don't tell me you forgot. Great. You know, I'm not feeling too well. I don't think a live performance is a good idea. Are you kidding me? This is gonna be huge, you have to do it. Stop goofing around. Now follow me and we can go. Mm, coming. Can't we just like switch to an interview? <laughs> what is wrong with you today? Are you feeling all right? Nothing, I'm fine. You have five minutes in the dressing room and then we'll be back for you. Mm -hmm. How do I get out of here? Right now. I think I can fit out this window. Are you trying to climb out of a window right now? No. Really, because you had your head out there. <sighs> Shit on a stick. Hey, sis, could I borrow a top to wear to school today? No, you can't borrow my shirt because you smell like dirt. You didn't have to be mean about it. Could you at least give me a ride, please? No, you hoe. I am such a mess, I can't make it through school. Are you okay? Don't cry today. No, I think Josh is cheating on me. I saw his phone. I'm gonna punch that man till he can't stand. Dude, why are you rhyming everything like Dr. Seuss? Should I talk to him or just break up with him? He is a filthy rat and I'm gonna hit him with a bat. Hey Bailey, what's going on with you? Jack, you gave me a heart attack. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. My parents got me a motorcycle and I was wondering if you want to come on it after school. You're so crazy, I think I want to have your babies. Uh, yeah, I think we can make that happen. Slay! Didn't you wear that sweatshirt to school yesterday too? I'm in my depressed era. Okay, same, but what do you think about my new hair color? It's giving. For once, I actually feel so ready for this math test. Me when I lie. What? I'm not lying. I studied <laughs> so hard for this. Be fucking for real. You're jealous because you know I'm going to do better than you are. POV, you run into the pick me girl. You know, you are just such a bitch all the time, and I don't think I can be friends with someone like that. Slay. Dude, why are you talking like that today? You are being so annoying. Slay. I genuinely can't deal with this anymore. Why are you making that face? You're freaking me out. Bailey, you only got one question right on the recent test. I'm in my stupid era. That was the final. You're gonna have to retake this class. I might kill myself. A hundred? That means I'm the best. Did you just say that your score is a hundred out of a hundred? Yeah, isn't that a good thing? No, that means you are in dead last place. Sis, that is not a good score. It's probably because you have no friends. But I have friends. Not the squishmallows you bring to school. Those are my friends. Well, you need to make friends with real people if you want to raise your score at all. Hey, do you guys want to be friends with me? Absolutely not. Get away from our table, weirdo. Okay, I guess I'll just try someone else. Bailey, literally get away from our table or I'm gonna call the police. I think it's time you found out about the rumor. What rumor? Your ex told everyone that you stole from their house. Hey, um, excuse me. Okay, I just want 2011. What? 
2002, I was an infant. What happened to my eyebrow? What are you talking about? They look great. I have like six hairs left. Yeah, thin eyebrows are all the rage right now. I love them. Do you at least have something to fix my lips? Why would you need to fix them? You're already wearing lip gloss. Now let's go. Please tell me you're not using a Nokia. This is the best phone on the market right now. What else would I use? I have the biggest crush on Justin Timberlake. Who's your crush? Uh, Harry Styles. Who the hell is Harry Styles? He was a skater boy, she said, see? You know that song? Yeah, it came out like a month ago. I'm so obsessed with it. I keep hearing it on the radio. Yeah, me too. You, everyone run. It's Jessica. She is so emo. What's wrong with being emo? Mom, what was in that drink you gave me? Uh, nothing. You're gonna be just fine, honey. Wait, but... She hung up on me. Bailey, I am so glad you came back. I just missed you. Missed you too. You have to give me your makeup routine. You look so good. What foundation do you use? I use peanut butter. Oh, would you look at that? The day's over. See you later. Bye. Mom, tell me what was in that drink right now. Fine, but you cannot share anything I'm about to tell you. I won't. What you drank this morning was a love potion. I'm sorry, a uh, humana what? A potion. You're just kidding, right? No, I'm a witch, and I have been my entire life. A witch? Like the Wicked Witch of the West? No, I only use my potions for good things, I promise. Since you've consumed one of my potions, you have to become a witch now, too. What? Wait, how are we gonna take her down? What do you mean? I'm the only one who knows her biggest secret. Okay, and what would that <laughs> secret be? You'll see, when I tell everyone. Mind if I just send a text blast? Oh, I got it. What? No way she did that. She slept with her mom's boyfriend? Yep, she told me about it. You bitch, I can't believe you would even do that to me. What? What did I do? Don't play dumb. I know you sent out that text everyone saw. I don't know what text you're talking about. You are fucking done. You hear me? You're done. Let's go. Bye-bye. Yo, that was like kind of badass. What? Okay, I gotta ask, why are you even helping me? I thought you didn't like me. Why would you think that I don't like you? <laughs> You make fun of me every single time you see me. I'm just teasing, I'm not serious. Right. Bailey, there you are. Oh, hey Jessica. You need to look at what Mel just sent everyone. <gasps> Fuck. Oh, hey honey, are you on your way to school right now? Mm -hmm. Farewell. <laughs> Please tell me you're not gonna talk like a psycho again today. Finally. Thank you, that was so annoying. I thought you were gonna be like that forever. Forever? This morning, Josh asked me to be his girlfriend. Do you think that I should say yes? Fast. I mean, yeah, we only met like two weeks ago, but do you really think so? Fuck. Dude, what? I am not doing that. I just met him. Fornicate. You are actually being the worst ever right now. Why are you only saying words with the letter F? What's wrong with you? Fear. You are giving me a headache. I gotta go. Farewell. Hey, babe, what do you think about this new shirt? My mom got it for me. Father. I didn't know I looked that good. Do you really think so? Feisty. I was thinking that you could come over after school. What would you want to do? Fuck. Ooh. Hey, you can't touch anything. Why not? You can only touch three things today. I don't understand what the big deal is. You have to save them in case of an emergency, okay? I'm sure it'll be fine. You can only touch your own body or things you're already wearing. I know. Everyone take out your textbooks and open to page three. I can't. You can't touch anything again today, Bailey? Just how it is, I'm sorry. You can follow along with what we're doing on the board. Hey, do you think you can hand me a pencil by any chance? No, uh, I'm sorry. Why not? I can see that you can touch three things, just use one of them. No, I'm sorry, just ask someone else. I want you to do it. Hey, what are you doing? Let go of me! Look, it's not that hard. Bitch, did you just slap me? Yes. You're gonna regret doing that. I'm sure mom's not gonna mind if I just borrow one pair of sunglasses. Dude, mom's gonna kill you if she sees you wearing those. Whatever, she's out of town, so she's not gonna find out. She told you not to touch any of her stuff. And I don't care. You're gonna get in trouble. Come on, let's go to school. I'll drive. No, no, we can walk together. Why would you want to walk to school? It's like six miles away. I just really need to get some exercise in, so let's go. Hey, why are you wearing sunglasses inside? 
Um, I have pink eye in both of my eyes. Oh, ew. I guess you cannot come to the pool with us later then, right? No, you can't go to the pool. Why can't I go to the pool? Because it's closed. No, it's not. What are you talking about? I bet she doesn't know how to swim and that's why she won't come with us. Um, are you okay? Hello, Bailey. Um, I have to go. Why are you wearing those? I told you not to go in my stuff. Mom? Dude, my first kiss is supposed to be in one hour. Lucky, I hope that mine is soon too. Please be soon. What? Well, it can't be that bad. What does it say? 15 years. Did you read that right? Are you just kidding? How old are you gonna be in 15 years? 35. You're gonna be a 35 year old virgin. Shut up. Ew, why is everybody making out with each other? Once you kiss one person, you can kiss as many people as you want. Ugh, I want that to be me so bad. Well, when's your first one? Not anytime soon. Don't tell anyone, but I know a way you can fix it. Fix it? Fix it how? Like get your number of years to go down. I really don't think you're gonna like what you have to do. Just tell me. You have to prove that you're worth it and face your biggest fear in front of everyone. Happy birthday, 18. <laughs> Thanks, I'm so excited to be finally legal. Since you're finally old enough, I wanna give you this necklace to wear. It's cute, but why couldn't I have it until now? The necklace is enchanted and it holds all of our family fortune. Last thing, don't let anyone else touch it, ever. Congrats, honey. Thank you. There you are, happy birthday. Oh, uh, thanks you guys. Cute necklace, is that new? Yeah, my mom just gave it to me today. Do you mind if I see it? It's so cute. Uh, I can't take it off. <laughs> Why not? It's just a necklace. I told you I want to see it. I can't. That was so weird. Yeah, people go pretty crazy over the royal family crest. What? The necklace you're wearing is only for royal family members. Okay, I'm not a part of the royal family. Maybe it's a fake. You don't understand. The necklace won't clasp on anyone who's not in the family. What? I knew it. Who wouldn't have a crush on me? I'm perfect. How many crushes did you get, sweetheart? 101. I knew it. You're beautiful. I'm so proud of you. Yeah, whatever. Bailey, how many crushes do you have? I have 101. Cool. I have 115. What? Yeah, I have 115 crushes. I mean, of course, who wouldn't like you? <coughs> Catfish. Sorry, did you say something? Oh, I didn't say anything. I'll just go flirt with all the new kids this year, and then I'll definitely pass her. This is too easy. I've already gone up 10 crushes. Bailey, hmm? I just met the whole football team and my crushes went up by 30. Isn't that crazy? Good for you. And Jake finally asked me to be his girlfriend. It was so cute. You're having a great day, aren't you? Hey, Jake, this is my best friend, Bailey. Hey, nice to meet you. Ugh, my hair is itching my neck. No! What the hell am I wearing? 2004, I wanna go into the future. Sis, let's go, we're gonna be late. The car's already running. Coming. Do we play some music on the way? Oh yeah, do you have an aux cord? Um, no, what's an aux cord? I was just gonna play one of mom's CDs on the stereo. A CD sounds great. Wait, if I went back in time, that means I know the future. Sorry, did you say something? Nothing. Guys, I have something super important to tell all of you. What? What's going on? In 2007, they're gonna come out with this thing called the iPhone, and it's a phone with no buttons. You just touch the screen. That is so cool. How do you know about the future? I have powers. Are there any flying cars in the future? No, but there's self-driving cars. Come on, don't stop now. Tell us something else. Also, I'm gonna be a rock star with a single called Romance is Dead. No way. Can I get an autograph? Oh, hey mom, good morning. Ew, why do you sound like a grandma? Uh, I, I don't know, why do I sound like this? Guys, don't panic. Everyone's gonna sound like this until we all find our soulmates. But I'm married. What? I mean, I just sound like this until I find my soulmate. It makes me want to scratch my eardrums out like this too. I don't know, okay? I have to find my soulmate so I can get rid of this. Don't act like you don't already know who your soulmate is. <laughs> what are you talking about? Everybody knows that you're in love with Stacy. Uh, what? I am not in love with Stacy. Yes, you are. Don't lie. Look, there she is. <laughs> Stacy, what's wrong? My mom kicked me out of the house because I told her that I like girls. First? I've never gotten first in anything. Mom, are you proud of me? Look at my score. Oh, honey, that's a really, really bad score. 
You know what? It's actually great. You are just so amazing. Now let's get to school. Okay. Bailey, I knew you were stupid, but a one out of 10, come on. I am not stupid. Really, what's the capital of the United States? The equator. No, it's not the equator. You have to get your score up. That is so embarrassing. No, I don't. I'm in first place. You're definitely confused. That is not a good score. Hmm? You're never gonna be able to do anything with that score. We need to raise it. We should just add a zero to it. Yeah, that's a great idea. We can't do that, Bailey. You have to get smarter. Attention students, the government has decided to eliminate anyone with a score lower than two on the intelligence scale. Why are you looking at me? It includes you. 2004, haven't I been there before? Hey, new girl, come over here and sit with us. Um, okay. Hi. <gasps> I love your bracelet. Where did you get it? I found it on the floor. Thrifty, so cute, I love it. Anyway, my name's Regina, this is Karen, and over there's Gretchen. Wait, like from that movie? Um, what movie are you talking about? Uh, never mind. You should sit with us for the rest of the week. Oh, I... We like never invite people to come sit with us. Great, it's settled then. Oh, and on Wednesdays, we wear pink. Okay, great, I'll see you guys tomorrow then. That's so fetch. Gretchen, stop trying to make fetch happen. It's never gonna happen. Did I teleport into the Mean Girls movie? 2018, why? Isn't this the year my mom met her new husband? I hate that man. I bet I can stop them from meeting each other. Mom, where are you going? I'm about to go out on my first date with this guy. I really don't think you should. I actually just threw up all over my bedroom. Something is seriously wrong. Oh my gosh, are you feeling all right now? No, I feel faint. Just clean it up and rest, I have to go. Oh, wait, I, I also lost the dog. We don't even have a dog. Yeah, I went to the shelter and I got a dog, but then I lost it, so we have to go find the dog. Enough with this nonsense. Wait. What now? The man you're about to go out with is a serial killer. What? What are you talking about? Oh, it's all over the news. He looks just like the sketch. I can't stand you right now. I have to go. She can't leave or the house is on fire. 2017. This is when I was dating Kyle, wasn't it? He ended up cheating on me, so I think it's time I get some payback. I'm just gonna switch out his shampoo for some Nair. <laughs> hey babe, I'm just gonna take a shower. Okay, have fun. Thanks, I guess I will. What happened to my hair? Where did it go? Oh no, I knew you were balding, but I didn't think it was that bad. I'm not balding, what did you do? I didn't do anything. You must have just used the wrong one, you poor thing. Let's go get you a wig. Okay, yeah, I, I guess that'll fix it. You sit down and leave it to me. I'm gonna find you a wig that looks just like your old hair. You are such a great girlfriend. Yeah, he'll take the hot pink one with the pigtails. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Oh, and you can just glue it straight on his head. Don't show him. All right, I'll turn him around. Why would you <laughs> pick this wig? I look like Pinkie Pie. I'm breaking up with you. 2019. Wait, yes, I can stop my mom from getting married. Hey, are you the makeup artist for today? Yes, I am. Do you know where I should go? You can actually go home. My mom canceled the whole wedding. Wait, um, are you sure? Yeah, bye-bye. Honey, -bye. where did the makeup artist go? She was just here. I don't know, she must have left. No, what am I gonna do? Don't worry, mom, I can do your makeup. Thank you, honey. Yeah, just close your eyes. You're gonna look great. All done. Ah! Oh, why did you turn my eyebrows blue? I thought that was brown. Silly me. Ah! Oh, I need to go wipe this off. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone. <laughs> this drink is so good. I wonder if it stains. Oops, that white dress is kind of looking like tie-dye now. Oh, my dress! What happened to my dress? <gasps> Must have been a ghost because it wasn't me. I'm done time traveling. I can't do it. 2015. You know what? I might as well make some money off of this. Everyone, I'm a psychic and I know everything about the future. Give me $20 and I'll tell you whatever you want. I want to know if this huge pimple is ever going to come off my back. Mm. You know, you should probably ask your doctor about that. Keep the money. Here's $20. Tell me if I'm ever going to be in love again. No. Tell me if my balding is gonna get worse as the years go on. Yeah, your head's gonna shine like a disco ball in the middle of the room. Are you kidding me? I don't wanna be bald. Sorry.
I need to know if me and my girlfriend are gonna get married one day. She cheated on you with your dad. What? I knew it was weird that they were spending time together. Mm -hmm. Please tell me if I'm ever gonna get over my last ex-girlfriend. Absolutely not. Tell me how to change my name. I can't be called PP Time forever. The only way that you can change your name now is to go and steal one from someone else. What? I'm not doing that. I knew you would say that. What happens if I just hit the decline button again? No, no, you cannot do that. Why not? Because your name will be completely randomized. It might be better. Or it could be like way worse. Fine, how do I steal a name? All you need to do is slap someone in the face and their name transfers over to you. Hey, Taylor. Oh, hey girl, what's going on? Dude, why did you just slap me? You said that would work. Okay, I was just kidding. I didn't know you were really gonna do it. Mm. Sorry, I think your only choice is just to hit decline. Okay. Please. Mike Hunt. Whoa, I'm sorry. What did you just say? Mike Hunt. That's what it says. Do you hear yourself? Mike Hunt. I can't even say that with a straight face. You should have took pee pee time. I know that now. There has to be someone I can talk to to fix this. Try going to their headquarters here. Hi, I'm- Take a ticket and wait in the line. Your number will be called. Okay. Number 69, Mike Hunt. Please don't call me that. So, what seems to be the problem? All of the names that I got were prank names. That's odd. Was it every name you got? That is definitely not right. We'll fix it for you. Really? Amazing. According to our database, someone hacked into your name system. Why would someone do that? To block you from getting your true identity. Have you met your family before? I live with them? No, I mean like your birth family. I'm sorry to tell you this, but I think you were kidnapped as a kid. What? My soulmate is only one mile away. I need to shave my legs. Great, now I have no hair, but a bunch of razor bumps instead. My soulmate is close again. Quick, you need to go and shave your legs then. I can't, I'm still recovering from the razor bumps from last time. I can't keep watching you suffer. You need to try you like. What's that? Put on the sunglasses and trust me. Okay. This doesn't hurt at all. And now you'll be completely hair free in just four weeks. No way, so with this I could meet my soulmate at any time. I think I'm finally ready to meet them since now I have no hair forever. Hey, I think you're my soulmate. Why do you look like Bigfoot? Hey, is this biology? Uh, yeah, it is. Then why is nobody else in here? Oh, someone stabbed the teacher and nobody really comes to class anyways. Okay. Do you want to take a sip of this? What is it? Uh, it's red wine and a bunch of stuff I found in my dad's closet. It's 8 a.m. on a Wednesday. When you guys talk, I see rainbows coming out of your mouth like a unicorn. I think we need to call the nurse. We don't have a nurse anymore. She got scared and quit. What kind of school doesn't have a nurse? Don't look now, but it's Nate Jacobs. Him and Maddie are fighting again. That kid's in high school. He looks like he's 27. That girl is not wearing clothes. Do you guys even have, like, a dress code? Nah, last time they enforced that, a teacher got bitten. Mm. Do you want a hit of this? Are you smoking inside? <sighs> yeah. Do you want some or not? I'm good. Thank you. <sighs> what the hell are these? Mute or delete what? I don't have a computer or a TV. Honey, did you clean your room already? Yeah, I did. And did you walk the dog? Mm-hmm. Have you taken out the trash? It's still here. Uh, no, not yet. I can't believe you would do this to me. I support you every single waking minute of your life. You don't have any respect for me at all. <laughs> it's for people. <laughs> Cat got your tongue? I have to go to school. You can take out the trash yourself. Jackson's coming over. Don't you like him? Yeah, he's so cute. Jackson, I was just telling Bailey about the time she peed herself in the car. Marissa, what the fuck? She couldn't make it to the restroom in time and she just... <laughs> Hey, Jackson. Listen, I've heard the rumor that you like me and I just don't feel the same way about you. You're kind of ugly. What? Yeah, and you're short. I want my kids to be D1 athletes. Wait, don't do that. Please put me in the year close by. 2024, that's perfect. Bailey, I heard that Sarah was gonna come ask you out. Really? But she didn't like me last year. She does now, but your skin is so oily. Hey. You need to fix it. I'll just use my perfect diary powder. It's so blurring. Isn't putting more on top gonna mess up your makeup? No way, it's super lightweight and waterproof. Oh my gosh, I need to try that. See how smooth my skin looks? I feel refreshed. Give me that powder. I need that powder now, give it to me. No way, I'm not gonna give you my favorite powder. Choose between smart or pretty? What, why can't I be both? 
I'm not picking one. This is stupid. The first group for this project will be Bailey, Tyler, and then Steven. <sighs> Listen, Blondie, you can just put on lip gloss or whatever you do. Leave this to us. Excuse me? I'm probably smarter than you are. Yeah, right. <laughs> You're probably dumb as a rock. We'll see about that. The answer is 42. <laughs> That's not right. I am not wrong. I did the math. What are you talking about? I can do it for you. You're not going to be doing anything. Yes, Bailey? Could I do this project alone? Are you sure? It's a lot of work. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, if you insist. Good luck getting an F on this project. Good luck balding at 25. You got the highest score on this project by far. <laughs> really? You're the only one who got a 98. That is <laughs> not possible. There must be some kind of mistake. Bailey, you need to come with us right now for breaking the system. $20 to me or my mom. I don't really need it right now, so maybe she can use it. Hey, that bracelet is so cute. When did you get it? Oh, I used the $20 that I got this morning to go and buy it. What did you get? I gave my 20 to my mom, so nothing. That's cute or whatever, but I needed this bracelet. Do you see how cute it is? A new car? What? Well, if I give it to my mom, she'll probably just give me her old one, so... Dude, there is no way you gave that one to your mom, too. I'm gonna get a G-Wagon for my car. <sighs> Wait, why aren't you taking any of them for yourself? I don't know. I'm happy with what I have, so it's fine. Okay, you are insane if you give this one to your mom, too. Well, I'm probably still gonna live with her anyway, so it's our house. You have fun with that? I'm gonna go live in a mansion, okay? I just know you're gonna <laughs> regret that. Ooh, I could get a mansion on the beach. Um, did you just get another one, too? Um, no, I only got the three questions before. I think I just got $10 million. Um, what? What do you mean? It just says plus $10 million. Dude, what? You are so lucky. You have to give me some of that. You can have some. I can't keep it all, but I have to tell my mom. Why do you give everything to your mom? You should keep it for yourself instead. Maybe I want to, okay? I love her. I want some of the money, too. Yeah, you better give me some for lunch. Me, too. Um, I have to go. Honey, I'm sorry, but there's leftovers in the fridge for dinner. I didn't have enough money for a new meal tonight. You don't need to worry about it anymore. Why? What are you talking about? Check the bank account. How many zeros is that? Ten million dollars? Where did you get all of this from? Thank you so much. This is going to change our lives. I love you. You guys need to give me all of the money right now. Whoa, hang on a second. You need to transfer all $10 million into my account by the end of the day or else. Save my mom or save all the money. You have to keep all the money, sweetheart. It'll change your life. No, mom, I can't do that to you. At least I would die knowing that you'll stay happy. I'm sorry, we can find money another way. No way, you actually just gave me all of the money. See you later, suckers. I can't believe you just did that for me. I love you. Of course, I love you. We need to find some other way to make money. I'll get a second job. It'll be fine. I'll be happy with anything as long as it's with you. Me too. Bailey, I heard a rumor that you actually lost all the money. Yeah, it's true. I bet you're so jealous now that you have nothing. I have such a nice car and a house. Whatever. You are just so dumb. I would have saved all the money over my mom. You know what? Even if I did have the money, I wouldn't have given any of it to you. Why? What? You said that you would. You're just kind of a bitch. Um, excuse me? Hey, uh, why are you standing like an NPC? I don't know, and I can't move. You look so funny. I'm taking a pic. Ha! What is wrong with you? You just punched me in the face. Sorry. I didn't even do anything wrong, too. I'm not doing it. My soulmate is. Well, your soulmate sucks. Help! What are you stuck on? There's nothing in front of you. I don't know. Okay, where the hell did you get that broom from? It just appeared in my hands, so I guess it's mine now. Can you please put the broom down? You're freaking me out. I can't. Whatever, let's just keep going. Are, are you dancing? Hey, yo, bro's kind of got the moves. Where did you get those and what are you doing? Ah! I gotta go. Bye. Hey guys, get ready with me for EDC day one. Also, if you don't know what EDC is, it's a rave that goes like all night. My Coachella outfits were insane, so I have to match the energy. This is from Disco Lemonade and it is insane. Here's the first part of the fit. I'm also gonna put these that go on your legs. I don't know how to explain it, so I'm just gonna show you. Next up, we have a pair of matching gloves. Okay guys, I'm so sorry. My light literally died, but this is the final fit. We got a choker and some rings and another necklace. I put on my combat boots and we are ready for EDC day one. I am so excited. Hopefully I can stay up all night.
the fantasy of us lives on inside my head And I'm trying not to give up I'm so sick of putting effort in I'm so back to just give a shit And I won't beg Romance is romance instead Weekend one of Coachella is sadly over, so I'm gonna rate all the outfits that I wore this year. Okay, this was my day one outfit. I'm obsessed with it. It's giving 2000s Avril Lavigne. The only thing I would have changed about this is I wish the short was like ever so slightly shorter. But the Converse were a smart pick because last year I wore heels and I learned my damn lesson. I'm gonna give this one like a seven out of 10. Day two, oh. I was dying over this and everyone else was also dying over this. It's giving bitch on the back of the motorcycle that you can never stop thinking about when you see her. This is a 10 out of 10. I would have not changed anything about this look at all. It was perfect. This is day three and it was really, really cute, but so impractical. I had to fully tape the top to my body because it would not stay where it was supposed to be. The skirt was also falling. You can see my underwear in this pic, but regardless, it was iconic. I'm gonna give this one like a nine out of 10. The fringe gloves, oh. I'm so sad that Coachella is over, but I'm also glad that I had a redemption arc from whatever my outfits were last year. One for the money, two for the show. One for the money, two for the show. One for the money, two for the show. Okay guys, I just got back from the festival day two and my hair is looking a little crazy, but the makeup has stayed on for the entire duration of the festival because of this NYX Cosmetics mattifying setting spray. It is so impressive and look at these stars. Today I'm gonna to be picking out my outfit with a blindfold on. We have moved to the inside of my closet and I'm just gonna blindfold myself. I don't even know where I'm going. We're just gonna reach this one. I feel like I should look. <laughs> okay, we might as well pick out a coat too. What's this? Oh, I actually really like this jacket. Now on the floor and whatever the first shoes I touch are, I'm gonna wear them. Okay. Oh! This is my skirt drawer, honestly. I, oh. I'm just gonna dig through here. I'm gonna go for the bottom ones because I don't even know what's down there. What am I holding on to? Okay, hello? Let's just try on the full fit and see what it looks like. Are we ready for the final fit? Because I don't know if you can handle all this. <laughs> Upon putting this top on, I realized that it's actually broken. This is kind of a moment. And then we just lift the leg, mm, put it back down, put it back down. Rate my outfit one to 10 in the comments. <laughs> Hey guys, get dressed with me for Coachella day one! Woo! I have my day one outfit all together and they just get better as the days go on. We're starting out with this like mermaid core bra. I'm obsessed with it. This is the bra on. It's giving aquamarine and I'm so here for it. Next we have tights in this really, really cool skirt that has a slit on the side. I lowered you guys so you can see. I'm wearing the tights and then the skirt has this awesome slit on the side. I love it, it's so flattering. This is crazy. It's this really shredded shrug that just goes over your arms. I feel like I'm definitely I'm gonna keep getting caught on people in the crowds, but it's super cool regardless. For shoes, we have some platform Converse I just got and these leg warmers. To finish it off, I have some fun Y2K glasses and this is our final look. It is definitely an improvement from what I wore last year and I love it.
The dating standards in 2023 are literally on the floor. Like when did a date become getting in a car and just sitting in the parking lot? I just want someone to serenade me. Is that too much to ask? If you agree that romance is dead, then you're gonna like this song. I keep Is it too much boob? Carson's so cute, but then look at Tiffany. Why are you touching your hair like that? It's a habit, okay? You kiss me in your car. My arm's looking really bare. I need like 17 more tattoos. Bye guys, thanks for coming over. I think they hate me. I just got this gigantic box in the mail. Okay, obviously I got a little excited and I already opened it. Basically, I'm going to EDC again this year, so there's a bunch of EDC stuff in here and Insomniac merch. First up, we got this iconic bucket hat. I'm gonna wear this every day. I might be weird, but I love getting socks and these have pink on them, so I'm sold. So excited about this. Are you kidding me? Look at the back too. This is the lineup of everyone who's gonna be at EDC. We have another Insomniac shirt. This one's really cute. I love black t-shirts. We got a keychain so you don't lose your things at the festival. Next up is a giant sweatshirt that's tie-dyed. I'm gonna put this on right now because I'm cold. Last but definitely not least, the ticket box. I'm gonna die. Look at this box. I think I'm holding it upside down, but it's still cool. Sleep mask, which I'm probably gonna need after being up the entire night. These are so cute. They're just little sequin patches. Another keychain. Also a bunch of stickers. I am so excited for EDC this year, and I really hope that I get to see some of you guys there. So let me know. Mwah, bye. I know you guys tell me to stop messing with my hair, but my bangs need a trim. Am I gonna go to a stylist? No. I'm gonna cut them myself with my baby tiny scissors. I just wanna do some baby pieces in the front because I don't trust myself, but I also can't see because of the bangs. Okay, I'm just gonna say fuck it and start cutting. <laughs> I don't wanna mess them up. That's my biggest worry that they're just gonna like look really bad. I don't think that that's even. I think I need to cut a little bit more on this side. Hopefully I won't <laughs> regret this. Okay, I'm too scared and I barely took anything off, but I can definitely see now, which is good. I think that they're cute and my hair is always really messy, so you probably won't even tell if they're kind of uneven. Get dressed with me for Coachella day three. Ah. I have this insane crochet fit today and I'm so excited to wear it. First up is this skirt and I honestly can't figure out which way is the top and which way is the bottom. Honestly, I am not sure that I put this on the right way, but it is so cute. This thing is supposed to go over your shoulders, but I'm gonna put it around my waist like a belt. I think that this is correct. I'm not sure, but now we have this crazy crochet bra. Maggie is tying this for me because there's a lot of moving parts and I'm struggling. Next up, I am putting on a leg garter. Time to put on some necklaces. I don't even know what's in here. I love gloves, so I have another pair that has fringe this time. Here is the final fit for Coachella day three. This is so impractical, but it looks so good, so I'm okay with it. No crumbs. No. No crumbs, bitch. <laughs> Come with me to make a snack because I might be a snack, but your girl still needs to eat. So I sprinted down the stairs. Then I remembered the special box I got in the mail. Whatever I'm doing, so is Milo. I definitely have an interesting lifestyle, so I love the snacks that you can just grab from the fridge throughout the day. 
And when I tell you these were bomb, I was shocked because I literally burn everything that I make, but I kept going back for more throughout the day because they were just that good. There's Milo again. Did you even work if you didn't have a tasty little treat while you did it? I was feeling a little extra spicy today, so I decided to make a drink too. Look at me being a little chef. Go, girl, go. I was making two drinks because of course I'm going to give the other one to my cat. He deserves everything. This drink revived me from all the work I did today. Snack for a snack, just like me. Do you or do you not feel bonita? I feel bonita. Wonderful, because you look bonita. I'm sure mom's not gonna mind if I just borrow one pair of sunglasses. Dude, mom's gonna kill you if she sees you wearing those. Whatever, she's out of town, so she's not gonna find out. She told you not to touch any of her stuff. And I don't care. You're gonna get in trouble. Come on, let's go to school, I'll drive. No, no, we can walk together. Why would you wanna walk to school? It's like six miles away. I just really need to get some exercise in, so let's go. Hey, why are you wearing sunglasses inside? Um, I have pink eye in both of my eyes. Oh, ew, I guess you cannot come to the pool with us later then, right? No, you can't go to the pool. Why can't I go to the pool? Because it's closed. No, it's not. What are you talking about? I bet she doesn't know how to swim and that's why she won't come with us. Um, are you okay? Hello, Bailey. Um, I have to go. Why are you wearing those? I told you not to go in my stuff. Mom? 2004, haven't I been there before? Hey, new girl, come over here and sit with us. Um, okay. Hi. Oh, I love your bracelet. Where did you get it? I found it on the floor. Thrifty, so cute. I love it. Anyway, my name's Regina, this is Karen, and over there is Gretchen. Wait, like from that movie? Um, what movie are you talking about? Uh, never mind. You should sit with us for the rest of the week. Oh, I... We like never invite people to come sit with us. Great, it's settled then. Oh, and on Wednesdays, we wear pink. Okay, great, I'll see you guys tomorrow then. That's so fetch. Gretchen, stop trying to make fetch happen. It's never gonna happen. Did I teleport into the Mean Girls movie? 2019. Wait, yes, I can stop my mom from getting married. Hey, are you the makeup artist for today? Yes, I am. Do you know where I should go? You can actually go home. My mom canceled the whole wedding. Wait, um, are you sure? Yeah, bye-bye. Honey, where did the makeup artist go? She was just here. I don't know, she must have left. No, what am I gonna do? Don't worry, mom, I can do your makeup. Thank you, honey. Yeah, just close your eyes. You're gonna look great.